To our team coverage of Ian in just a moment, but tonight we're also following a troubling story out of South Richmond. Police tell us a 17 year old boy was shot walking to a school bus stop this morning. Officers are still trying to track down the trigger man. On your side at six, Desiree Montia joining us live with more details about this case. This is awful, Desi. Yeah, Kurt, awful and gut-wrenching are just one of the many words neighbors here are using to describe this shooting as they try to wrap their minds around what happened, especially as this all unfolded in front of a group of students waiting at the bus stop. Experience anything like that. Devastation and sadness is what ran through Nikki Johnson's mind after hearing what unfolded near her home. I just heard like seven or eight gunshots, uh, which is very unusual for the neighborhood, especially first thing in the morning. Um, then I heard a sound like a car speeding off and then there was like a few moments of silence and then I heard the screaming. Along McDowell Road early Friday morning, Richmond police say a teen was shot while walking to a school bus stop. The 17 year old taken to the hospital fighting for his life. Richmond School Board Chair Dr. Shonda Harris Muhammad later shared on social media the student is stable very devastated that something like that happens, especially at that age. Richmond Public Schools says the Huguenot High School student was shot by someone in a passing car, adding other RPS students witnessed the incident. The fact that it's happening while kids are on their way to the bus stop, it's reckless, it's frustrating. Richmond City Councilman Mike Jones was at the scene, not far from his home. It's senseless. No child should have to, to live under this type of uh, circumstance, these situations. Richmond police have not released any details about a motive or suspect. Even my neighbors was, was like, oh my God, what what just happened? It, it was so surprising. A situation Nikki Johnson says has never happened in this tight knit neighborhood. It's extremely sad because this isn't a neighborhood full of strangers. You know, we we know each other. You know, I grew up with a lot of the neighbor's kids and, you know, it's just it's almost like family member or something like this happens to him. And of course, our heart, our thoughts and prayers go out to the student's family. And in a letter sent out by the principal of Huguenot High, they said that there was an RPS crisis support team there at the school to help out students and staff. And if you have any information to help Richmond police with this case, you can give Crime Stoppers a call at 804-780-1000. Live and on your side in Richmond this evening, Desiree Montilla, NBC 12 News. Certainly thinking of that student tonight. Thank you, Desi. Well, taking another live.